Hey my loves, welcome back to my channel. So for today's look, we're going to be using the new Glam Light Cake palette. So if you want to see how to do this, then please keep watching. So the first shade I'll be dipping into is the shade called Cranberry. And this is a Glitter Realm Co. brush, which I will link down below. I've already applied some concealer on my eyelid to use as a primer. Now I'm going to be packing this on the outer corner and I'm just going to V it out because I want it to be sort of like a wing instead of rounded. Now it might seem like this color isn't pigmented, but it is. I'm just taking a little bit at a time to really get it how I want it. Um, this brush, you might want to use a smaller brush to get it, to really get it into the crease area. This one is a little bit big, but I am making a do with what is clean right now. <laughs> So here I'm just taking a hint of peach because I want to see if it'll alter the color just slightly. I'm going to do the same thing and just go over, go over the same areas that I've already applied eyeshadow. Next I'll be taking the, the shade called Ube on this little blending brush right here. Now when using these brushes and blending out, you might want to invest in smaller brushes which I really need to. Um, to, just depends on the type of blend you're going for, um, which is what I wanted to achieve here. But I still liked the way it came out anyways. So I'm going to be taking this shade and applying it right on top of the edge of that first shade. And I'm just going to really um, smooth it out and blend upwards with a very light hand. Now just keep in mind when blending, try to use small circular motions and a very soft hand. And then just keep blending until your hand falls off. No, just kidding. But seriously, just keep blending until it's as, it is as soft as you can get it. Next, I'll be doing a half cut crease with the concealer by Pretty Fresh by ColourPop called Pretty Fresh Concealer in the shade Light 40N. And this is a small up concealer brush. As you can see here, how I like to do them, I usually put majority of the concealer on my lid and then I slightly, slightly look up. And as you can see, it draws a guideline for me. And then I just take my brush and clean it up and follow that line as far down uh, on the lid as I like it. And when it gets to this edge, I just like to smooth it out with my finger really quick. And then next, I like to take my brush and just smooth out any excess concealer just to make it nice and smooth so that we can apply the eyeshadows. I'm not going to set it. I'm going to go straight in with the next color. So with the flat brush, I'll be taking the shade called Icy Mint and I'm going to apply that on the first part of the concealer. Now I like to use padding motions. I'm going to press it right on there so that it will stick and then I'm going to layer it to really deepen it up. Next we're going to go ahead with the shade called Key Lime and we're going to apply that right next to the first shade that we used. The same technique, I'm going to pat it on and then just slowly build up that color. Next I'll be taking the color called Pineapple and I'm going to do the same thing and apply this next to the green. And then for the last two steps on the lid, we're going to be taking Peach and then right next to that we will finish it up by taking some more of Cranberry to complete the edge. Now for the lower lash line, I'll be applying some of Cranberry and I'm going to blend it out with Ube. To highlight, I'll be using the one by Ofra Cosmetics called Space Baby. And this is one of my new favorites. And then I will be using Ofra HD Volumizing Mascara today. I'm also going to apply this Insomniac Cream Gel Liner into my waterline. And lastly, I'll be adding some falsies. So this completes the look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up and thank you so much for watching. Have a blessed week and we'll see you next time.